I hate playing like a scrub or a scum or whatever. I really do. I, I like playing like mad respectful. Like I won't like I won't hit you when we get Kato or anything like I mean even if I get upset like or annoyed yeah I might want to fucking like do it but I won't do it you know because I'm respectful like that but when you start doing that mm -mm. start doing all them scummy shit <clears throat> really I don't know I think it's mad that's disrespectful Especially if you ain't skipping your intro after the second time we play. I'm legit going to start going to locals and telling people they need to skip their intro and outro. Like, come on. We on limited time. I'm trying to get my $20 work. Like, come on. You've seen that shit a billion times. <laughs> I, I don't. I fought some pro the other day, and they didn't even play their main, and then when I beat them, they was like, oh, I'm not gonna cheese you anymore, or whatever, from what I've told. But I'm like, I'm like, it's for the best. Like, you wasting my time. Like, you know, like, I hate, that's why I don't like fighting pros or whatever. I don't even... This is like, they all want to stay in their own little fucking bubble, and they don't want to fight nobody else. And then, like, if they see, like, they see me, and they like, oh, sh this person's trash, and they only want to fight their main. I don't have time for that. I'm fighting everybody with my main, because I'm trying to get, like, I'm, getting, I'm trying to learn everything I can learn for Nina. Like, I don't have time to be, like, cheesing nobody, because... I don't have I don't have time to cheese nobody because first of all I can't cheese nobody because I'm trash in this game so I don't have time for that. I don't got time for people wasting my time because I could just be playing somebody else honestly. It's a waste of time. Like I don't like the idea of sandbagging. I can understand if it's like someone who's new new at the game like you know if they're really new and you don't want to you know just demolish them in the sense where you're trying to teach them the game then yeah play somebody else or like you know get easy on them but like if you playing in quick matches and you see me you better not go easy on me because <laughs> I'm, I'm somebody you want, don't want to sleep on <laughs> I'll just say that I'll take all my lumps but like I'm watching what you're doing <laughs> yeah we got dial up speed over here so it might take me a second to understand what you're doing but once I get what you're doing you better figure something you better do something new I don't go and another thing is like I don't go easy on people cause I don't want people to go easy on me there's nothing the worst feeling is to know someone was going easy on you. Like, that's the worst fucking feeling. Unless you don't really care, like, and you're just like, whatever, oh, I won. But, like, if you're a real competitive person, someone going easy on you is, like, a disrespect. And me being a female, that's already as annoying as it is. Like, I mean... Yeah, actually, I want y'all to go easy on me, so, like, <laughs> I, <laughs> when we in pools, I have an easier time. But on no seriousness, I don't want nobody to go easy on me. I get mad if someone does that shit, honestly. Because either you can beat me or you can't. Sitting the singles for you, like. But... With that said, like, if, if I realize I can just, if I'm steamrolling somebody, I might not give them, I might, if I steamroll somebody, I'll give them two matches just so they have an idea of what's going on. Because I feel like that's fucked up. Because new players also have to learn. But if you're like a mighty ruler, I'm just giving you one match, dog. <laughs> Ask me to play me. Uh, I don't know. Like, if I tell you, 
I've cried so many times in this fucking game, dog. I've cried. I never cried on stream. Because <laughs> I ain't a bitch, honestly. But <sighs> it's just something about like competitive games like Tekken. Where it's just like you just get destroyed in this game and you just, oh, you just feel it in your soul, dog. This game will make you feel every emotion. I can understand, in all seriousness, I understand why a lot of girls can't play, like, can't or don't want to play fighting games because fighting games are fucking hard. Especially as a female, because you have, like, a lot of emotions. Like, like getting your ass kicked over and over like a hundred times. Like, I've gotten my ass kicked a hundred times and not win once. And you just gotta sit there and play over and over and over and over and over again. Because if you don't, you're not getting better. And if you stop playing, you're gonna get even worse. It's just like you're just sitting there playing and fucking tears are just coming out of your eyes while the, you're trying to play and the tears are going on your fucking controller and making you mess up your inputs. Dude. <laughs> Fighting games are so fucking hard, dog. Uh... I don't know. I feel like it's something you got to test the waters with. But man, this game has made me shed some tears. Some real tears. That's why you. That's why I don't like to cheese on people, you know? Because I know the struggle of getting good in this game a real struggle that's why you see like a lot of martial arts artists are like mad humble and shit cause they know the struggle <laughs> and, and plus there's too many people playing this damn game right now that you can't even be a villain in this game the only way you be a villain in this game honestly is just you just fucking everybody up and you're not even like being smug about it you know like you could just be a really nice person but just beat everybody and you're just labeled as a villain that's the only way you can be a villain nowadays <laughs> uh, she she was mad <laughs> yeah i mean i don't know yeah i guess if you if you can see someone visually mad and like I don't know, it's such a hard thing to know with people, you know? Because if you stop playing them, they, they're more like they get more mad. But if it's, like, a female, I'd probably, like, if I realize I'm fucking her up or something, I'd probably stop playing, too. game got me on the soul searching you know like looking at other like like other people what they've done like chess masters and fucking judo masters like one thing right now is for me is like I'll get mad like I guess you know player match is technically sparring you know I could win 50 fucking times in this game I could have a 50 streak and somebody will fuck me up just once. It could just be once and I just get mad. That's something I'm trying to deal with now. I think it's just something you just have to like experience a billion times before your body just gets used to it. I could, re like I legit could win 50 times. 50 times and I lose once and I'm like, it just fucks me up. I think it's just because like that one time you lose is just realize somebody figured out, figured you out, and that's what pisses you off about it, you know. Or is this you realize you don't know as much as you know? And I don't really say, oh, I know everything, but it's just, it's just that part where you get frustrated, you know. Mm. 
nice audio. Thank you. You get used to it? Yeah. It's easier for a guy, though. I'm not even joking. You guys can just, like... I don't know. You guys have that whole emotion thing in check. Us females, it's just like, oof. <laughs> you look at me wrong. You don't skip your intro, and I'm mad. Like, if you win... If you took my streak and you win and then you don't skip your intro the next time, I'm mad. I'm legit mad. I really want, I want to throw some hands, dog. You know how many times in this game I want to throw hands? <laughs> Even online. It's back to normal. Yeah. I'm about to go. <laughs> it's getting late. It is getting late. It's not getting late. It's getting early. Honestly. Ah, <sighs> man. Yeah. <laughs> I know, right? Like, as soon as I lose, I'm like, this, this guy is trash. He's so fucking trash. Oh my god, this character is trash. I always start blaming the character and shit. <laughs> Sometimes it is a fucking character, though. Honestly, shit. Like, Horang? He's a... Oh, man. He's... Oh, boy. I didn't even launch that. I hate when I... I hate when I do that. Because you want to end the fight with Horang fast. You don't even want... <laughs> you don't even want to let Horang do his fucking gimmicks. Him and Ling, you, you just don't want them to do start the fucking bullshit. Because once they start, you can't stop it. It's, what annoys me about Horang also is Horang is like Nina. He's a pressure character. Why he have a bunch of long-range moves? Nina don't even have long-range moves. And they... They're active the whole time. Like, he can just toss it out, like, on the other side of the fucking map. Oh my god. No, bitch. You tried it. I forgot you gotta duck it. You can't even hold back. So gay. Okay. I gotta I gotta slow this down. <laughs> I gotta slow this down. There are all of them? Whoa. Okay. On both sides they lean in though? Look at this. Look at this. You just gotta have patience. 